Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Dax, and I wanted to get this video out before the game actually releases. This is, uh, if you've read the title, you know what this is, but this is the game Sandland. The game I've been excited for ever since it got announced, I believe a little over a year and a half ago, or maybe a year ago. Well, but either way, the second it got announced and they released the Kira Toriyama did all the artwork and it's from his mind, and I'm a huge Dragon Ball fan, I had to go ahead and give this game a a, a look at so today we're going to be looking at the release date trailer as well as the game pay, gameplay trailer of this uh of the game i am super excited for it it looks like it's going to be a ton of fun i will of course be covering this game the second it releases so be looking forward to that on this channel uh the game i believe doesn't release till april so we got a little bit of time but i wanted to go ahead and get this out here that way y'all can be looking forward to it as much as i am so let's go ahead and get right into the video make sure you do like comment subscribe and let's uh check out these trailers The site of the great Aquanium explosion, and the one who pulled the, the great Aquanium explosion. Like you just look at it and tell it's from Army his mind. Me. We can't let it cause yet another tragedy. Oh, it looks so good. And like the main character dude looks so cool. I love his whole his whole entire look. Not that not her. I happen to be an ace mechanic. Not her, him. A little pink guy. For the legendary spring? If Aquanium is involved, this is a national emergency. It's getting dangerous. Have fun. <laughs> and he just sounds like he's having fun, but you can like look at the terrain and the it's just scale of it makes you feel like less than nothing. So awesome. The actual game is that gameplay? I know we're gonna get into a gameplay trailer here, but Oh, that looks so good. You can shoot the bird! Is that a laser? Are we racing? It's like so futuristic looking. I love the robots. Yo, he's in a little bike shooting. What? Is that a Kraken? That light. That's a quadium. Stand back, everyone. I'll take him out myself. That Zeo, is there no end to the secrets he was keeping from his own army? What? The nasty relics of that foolish war. I seriously don't understand human. I wonder what race that guy is. I've ne I don't know if there's an actual like manga. About so 426. So yeah, it does come out in April. I thought it was April. It's late April. And so I gotta say, I enjoyed that trailer. The trailer showed a lot, but didn't show a lot. It just really got into the more of what the meat and potatoes of story is possibly gonna be. So excitement for this. I'm telling you, this game is going to be really good. So let's go ahead and get into the gameplay trailer. It's about nine minutes long, so a little bit longer of a trailer. But let's go ahead and get into it. All right. In a distant future. Humans and demons live together in a deserted so, those, so he's a of demon. Life. He's Sand a demon. Lab. That makes sense. To restore the balance to the world, the fiend prince Beelzebub forms a strange trio. He's Beelzebub? And thief and the human sheriff Raul. Oh. Together, they will set off on an epic journey in search of the legendary spring. The legendary spring. Welcome to Sand Lab, an immersive and exciting action RPG. Oh, it looks so. So it is a manga. Okay, I might have to read that. I didn't know it was a manga. Overview of Sandlands gameplay. It looks good. its environments, gameplay systems, and unique elements. Toriyama out here writing other stuff. And memorable. Needs to be covering. Needs to be worried about finishing up my Dragon Ball Super, please. Alright, that's a joke. He probably wrote this long ago. You play as Beelzebub, Fiend Prince. In I'm a prince. Of your adventure, you will be accompanied by Thief and Rao, who will support you in and out of combat with unique skills, as well as oh, exactly. advises during your travel. Did the demon village always used to be where it is now? As far as I know, there is no record of us moving. Is Thief the old guy in the back or the old guy on the right of us? So long is a sign of good governance. I'm also me once the back. The thief the is the guy in the back. Sounds older. To is that? Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Is that Dodoria? 
that's who that is. I don't care what they say, what they try. That's who that is. To explore. Sorry. Encounter oh, look at the worm. Meet the mysterious Anne. A freaking but beware of a challenge mantis looking dude. The king's royal army, commanded by the supreme commander Zeu, is coming. He really took the red ribbon army and said, let's make them into a game, but not call it that. That's what's happened here. Beyond Sandland lies a greenish world, populated by even more unique and dangerous enemies. Be ready to advance in this adventure. What epic enemies are we defeating? Careful, your first fight is coming. Okay. Up. Okay, do we punch? Oh, we do. Beelzebub is a ferocious fighter that has access to light and heavy attacks, which can be chained both on the ground as well as in the air. Hold up, hold up. Back up, because that went by really fast. I will be pausing it throughout this one. So dark release, metalize, rush, and fury. Then we have rock throw. Okay. So we have special skills. Don't forget to dodge in midair and nice. sideways. Nice. Okay, he just got Sometimes raptor skills. Get closer to the enemy silently and as you progress in your journey, you will gain points that can be spent Oh, there's a skill tree. Skills. Okay. You will be able to power up special skills such as the ability to turn your body to metal or even dark release. So that's what metalize was. Okay. Dark at least kind of good if for crowd control. Don't forget that even the strongest fiend. I like his voice actor. So whoever that is. Okay, so obviously there's potions. Kind of figured. Your attacks, defense, and help you recover power of dark. Oh, you can. So make oh, okay. Sure to stock up. So it's not an MP. It's dark energy is also, what they're calling it. Water is an important resource that you can restock in water supply points. And will be consumed to heal your health in case you are about to be defeated. Oh. Okay, I thought it was good. Is there? Wonder if there's going to be a need for water. Like, are we going to have to do it if the water gets low because it's so hot? Because we're in the sand. Like we're in a desert basically throughout at least ninety percent of the game. It looks like. So I wonder if that's going to be a need. Otherwise, our health goes down, or if we're just going to have to get it. Unique features. Just for the health reason, just to get health back. The jump bot will bounce over high cliffs. Woo! The hover car can float over water to cross dangerous rivers. Works. And the battle armor can move heavy obstacles to open blocked paths. So there's gonna be puzzles. Remember, you can hundred percent five capsules, each containing a vehicle at any given time. So plan ahead according to the situation. So capsule corpse in this now too, huh? Like, like Akira <laughs> Toriyama went. Red Ribbon Army, Capsule Corp, will not only Demons. While yeah, we'll throw that all into a game. Be very useful in battles. Oh, With is that got a missile launcher on top? And resistance, vehicles can stand do, 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 do. And tank groups that Beelzebub alone Those are dragons. Okay. But be careful. If a vehicle is destroyed in combat, do you, you die? Go down with it. Oh, so you go die. You die if the vehicle dies. Comes in. Okay, good to know. I'm Anne, and it's your lucky day. I happen to be an ace mechanic. Your new ally Anne will help you to build, the up, and equip your vehicles. Vehicles can be equipped with powerful and different weapons, such as rocket launchers, lasers, machine guns, and shotguns. So you can be sure to always have the right. Holy crap! All oh, that is customization. Only part of the vehicles that you can customize. Well, cylinder engine. And suspensions will affect driving and boosting performance, while option parts will unlock special performances. Customize these various parts and make your. You can really have this vehicle, however. Yeah, you can have this vehicle just be your own personal whatever. There won't be very many vehicles that'll be the same. Vehicles to increase their durability. Oh, a dirt buggy. That increases how strong they are. Okay. Once your vehicle is fully equipped as you like, pay a visit to the paint shop to color it the way it reflects your style. And you get to change the colors. Boy. Okay. That's interesting. My man's in a red, a purple and green hover. hover. Okay, that one's pretty normal. I like the coloring of it of that one. That, that blue is really cool. 
Another of course, you're going to upgrade your attack. In battles is to unlock skill trees for your friends. Of course. So your friends also have a skill tree. Support you during fights by riding on the tank and attacking enemies. Well, Thief's talents will be evident outside of combats as he helps you get additional items or hunt for rarer loot. Huh. Okay. Dan also has access to her unique skill tree, which will focus on making your vehicles more efficient and powerful. Yeah. Altogether, the team will triumph over the greatest dangers. That's a sandfall. Quite the sight indeed. If only this were water, we wouldn't need the spring anymore. Holy crap. Yeah. During your quest, you will need a place to call home. Even though it may look ravaged and decayed, Spino is the perfect place to set up camp. Spino it has a to build and upgrade your vehicles, as well as merchants to purchase items from. The perfect place to rest between battles. But can we upgrade our merchants? Can we upgrade At the this town? Garage, create the ideal room that can be extended up to three times the original size. We get to have our own room? For what? With a wide selection of furniture, including walls, ceilings, and vehicles. <laughs> Whether in a modern, hideout, woods, or cyber style. That's pretty cool. Just a fun little thing there. When starting up, I'll have fun with Spino that. may not have many citizens, but it has the potential to grow. Furniture making. So this is perfect. Nice. This is one picturesque town. As you complete side quests, recover items, or defeat enemies, the town will evolve to the next stage, and you oh. can purchase rare components. So the town will upgrade. Oh, new opportunities for adventure. That town gets really big, considering it started from crumbled up More the houses. You in the Sandland world. Join we races to test your vehicle speed. We do get to race. Oh, you are done for. Hunt or battle arenas to put your strengths and abilities to the test against strong bosses. Huh? That's the robot from Dragon Ball. <laughs> they really put it in. Step into a world where your adventure is dictated by your bravery and imagination. That's awesome. On an epic I mean, it's his own. He could literally put Sans in here. He could. Nobody could say anything. He owns the rights. Sandland releases on April 26th. Oh, I'm so excited for that. Oh, the game's gonna be so good. Oh, we get Survivalist Camo Pack. All right, the Deluxe Edition. What do we get? We get a Demon Pack. We get some decals. We get housing DLC. Sure. Um, but the Speed Demon Pack is actually pretty cool. And obviously, the game. And then, of course, if you want the collector's bundle, you can have this very awesome game exclusive figurine, which looks really, really cool. But I probably won't be getting. And ladies and gentlemen, that is Sandland. So I am certainly excited for it. This game I've been excited for ever since they announced it. I've been looking forward to playing it. It looks like it's going to be a ton of fun. Got a little bit of everything for everyone. The art style is sweet. I love the art style. It's very comic book, manga-ish. So it's a very nice art style. So... For me, I'm going to enjoy this game. I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a blast. I certainly hope y'all do too. And I hope y'all enjoy my videos I do make on it as it does come out. So I'll thank y'all so much, very much for watching. Make sure you check out Sandland today. It's going to be a lot of fun uh, as soon as it comes out in April. Just check out all the different videos people have been making on it. And uh, y'all make sure you hug someone you love. Y'all have a good one. Make sure you use code DAXTHEWIZARD at checkout at G Fuel. Get yourself 20% off. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.